all right in this video we're gonna have a little bit of a drag race and this is just for fun on the left we have blender version 2.92 and this is uses regular cycles but it's also using optics and I have the RTX 3070 um, activated on this instance and over here we have uh, an experimental build using Cycles X and it's Blender 3.0. Now this is still experimental so I expect improvements but over here on this instance it has the 30, RTX 3060 applied to the instance. Now keep in mind the 3070 is probably between 60 and 70 percent faster at rendering than the 3060 and also the 3060 is also handling the screen capture at the moment and it's also driving my displays so the 3060 is already being used whereas the 3070 it's doing nothing right now All right, but we'll go ahead and do a drag race and we'll use this barbershop scene which is a fairly heavy scene I'm going to go ahead and click render and you know I'm not even in that big of a hurry to come over here and uh, I'll just tell you the truth I'll just wait until this actually starts rendering before I start this one just so I can show you how much quicker the Cycles X is render image I'm going to downsize that so you can actually see it now you can see that there is a little bit of a difference when it comes to how these render three point pardon me 2.92 still uses tiles pretty much like every other version of blender but when it comes to uh, blender 3.0 cycles X it renders all of it at one time and the cycles X version is already about it's coming up on 25 percent finished wherein the older version is barely a fifth of the way finished and this has a much more powerful GPU on it than this one and like I said this the 3060 that's running this is already being used for screen capture and to drive the displays alright the 3060 is halfway finished and you can see that the 3070 isn't even close to halfway finished. Whoops. I was trying to slide this over so you can actually see the sample count. Uh, oh, you can actually set five right there but it's only it obviously has to start counting over for every tile but it's counting up to 800 you can see just like this one is counting up to 800 and the cycles X version is just about finished it will be finished in another few seconds there you go it's already finished took less than two minutes this one has been going for two, about two and a half minutes and still has five and a half minutes left. That's a big difference. Now, just for fun, since I'm not going to sit here and wait for this one to finish, I'm going to escape out, of, press escape to stop. I'm going to close this window. Now I don't want to save it. I'm going to go full screen. I'm going to bring up this and put both GPUs on it and we're going to we're going to render this one more time with both GPUs render image and again this right here is running with the 3070 and the 3060 working together and it's quite a bit quicker than just the 3060 it's already 25 percent finished in 25 seconds
50% finished in about 38 seconds. It's already almost 700 samples in. One minute and one second. Now, I've ran this without running the screen capture, and I can do it in 59 seconds. So the screen capture did slow it down a little bit, but it only slowed it down by two seconds. But, yeah. big difference between uh, 2.92 and Blender 3.0 which will be coming out I would say probably I'm guessing I don't know I have no inside knowledge but probably later on this year or the first part of next year and it's way way quicker but anyway I just thought I'd show it to you because that's kind of interesting later people